stressing out. I'm at Starbucks. I ordered like two grande waters. Cause I'm probably gonna be in the car with Shadow. So yeah. Thank you. You too. I'm pretty sure she could tell that I was crying. You know, you can see it on my face that I'm going through it. So thank you for saying have a nice day, but I'm not really having a nice day. But thank you, I appreciate it. Hurry up! Damn! I hate cars right now. People are being so Oh gosh. You could have understood what I'd be your man, you think. I wanna drive you crazy. I wanna be your baby. He said, babe, you change me. I wanna be your man. It's your girl, little baby Lexi, and I'm here with another. I can't do it. Okay, let me try again. Hi, everybody! It's your girl, little baby Lexi, and I'm here with another video. Um, honestly, you guys wanted me to make a YouTube video, um, basically updating you guys, I guess, or like a day in my life every week. But honestly, I honestly hope I could post it because lately I've been recording for you guys and I've been trying to post it and I'll be editing and for some reason I'm gonna, like I am literally my number one hater at the moment. Like I'll be recording and then I'll edit and then I'm just like, this is horrible, like I can't post this, this is not, this is not good enough and then I'll delete it all, like I will delete everything. I've recorded like about almost 10 videos already and I've deleted every single one of them because I'm my own hater at the moment and I don't even know why like if I'm being honest I honestly think it's the fact that I think I'm not good enough it, I think that's the reason today I am getting shadow back so right now I'm waiting for my cat to be delivered to me from the guy that I am talking to because shadow was staying at his mom's house and shadow can't stay there no longer because he was being very loud and not letting the dad sleep because the dad wakes up at 4 a.m. for work every day it's kind of hard on him because he's been jumping place to place to place and yeah so I don't know I don't know what to do anymore like I'm really trying my best to get my place so shadow and I could be fine together but it hasn't been easy let me just say the guy that I'm talking to is one hell of a guy like the fact that he's been putting up with like my even though he doesn't have to because I already told him I was like hey bro like let me know when you're ready to dip because I know I'm a lot to handle and like I have baggage on my shoulders and he hasn't yet which is surprisingly crazy because a lot of has been happening like I honestly don't know what to do with my cat I barely found somewhere to live for myself I'm stressing about my cat like any time that my cat had to come back to me I would sleep in the car with him and the dude that I was talking to hated that he was like no stop like I don't want you sleeping in the car like I don't want you doing that not only that some of my families like they treat me like shit. so like not only that he's been seeing me cry over certain things that I've been told by certain family members and he's just like what the is going on but me and him were talking he was like it sucks cuz good people with good hearts always get hurt the most and he was like and that's what's happening to you at this moment oh my god let me update you on what the he told me oops what sorry my language but let me tell you what he told me i wanted to go to my car to go cry and he was like no sit down like stay right here you know and i think he knew i wanted to go cry so i was just like nah let me go to my car like i'm gonna go to my car like <laughs> i need to go to my car and he was like why like for what reason why are you gonna go to your car like what's going on like you know sit down so i sat down and i stayed there and i was like i need to go to my car and he's like tell me why and i was like because i need to cry like i want to cry and my only safe place is my car like I think most of you guys know that, like, I, I've already said it, I've never had a full-on home. I had nowhere to call home ever in my life, and 
my car is my home. Shadow is my home. My safe place is my car and shadow. And because I didn't have shadow at the moment, I only had my car. I was just like, I need to go to my car. Like, I need to go to my car. I want to cry. And he was just like, come here. Like, come here. Sit next to me. Like, you know, and I was just like, no, I don't. I don't like being touched. I don't like being hugged when I want to cry or I'm going to cry even more. Like, I hate being hugged. I hate the feeling of being vulnerable. I hate the feeling when people feel pity for me. I hate when people feel bad. Yeah, okay, so I cried in front of him. And he got up and he's like, get up, like, come here and hug me, you know? And I was like, no, no. And instead, he sat down on me, and he hugged me, and I was like, bro, get off of me. Like, you know, I didn't say that, but I felt that. I was like, get off of me, like, you know? Anywho, he um, grabbed my face, wiped my tears, and said, look, I know it's stressful right now. I know a lot of happening. He was like, same here, and you know what's going on with me. He was like, it's okay to feel sad, you know, go through the motion, let it all out. He was like, but you're not alone. He was like, I know you feel like you're alone, but you're not alone. Because I've been feeling like I've, I've been alone. Like, a lot of things have led up to the fact that I was starting to feel like I was alone. But he was like, look at me. He was like, you're not alone. He was like, I know you feel alone right now, Lex. But you're not alone because we're in this together. Like, you know? And I've never heard a guy in my life. I've never heard... A friend or a guy that I'm talking to or my ex ever tell me we're in this together like you know like I've never or a family member you know I've never heard anyone tell me that I'm not alone and we're in this together type thing and he was the first one to tell me that and it felt so weird like I don't know how to explain it but I was just like what did he just say we're like trying to grow together like we're but like you know what I mean like trying to reach certain goals because our quote-unquote relationship we're putting it on the side like you know like we're like yeah it's important but we're not focused on that we're we're more focusing on getting to know each other fully and growing together and helping each other grow like that's what we're mostly focused on i know you guys want an update on him he hasn't asked me out it just isn't fair Um, we're not rushing it. We go on dates. Yeah, we hang out a lot. Yeah, I go to his soccer games But we don't really go out as much because we're both trying to save up for certain things in our life But yeah, so anywho, um, I'm over here waiting for him to bring me my child and he's taking a little long By the way, it's 9 30 August 30th uh, 2022 I just dropped the mic and uh, we would just have to fix it up, right? And she said 80% of it will be my room. So it's my room. But the other percent would be her room because she's trying to do nails. And she said, yeah, I would be able to have shadow. For real? <laughs> she said, I guess. Bro, you see yourself so cute. Fucking be <laughs> You were over here crying with me. You were. It was sweet, though. There we go. Why are you crying out of happiness? Because, yeah, crying out of happiness. My mom was allergic to cats, but. But she's still. I didn't know that! Why did you tell me that? I would have never. Oh my god. Look, smells nice. Oh my god. <laughs> what the hell is. Ah! Stop! Don't tickle me. Shadow is in the back somewhere over there. Somewhere over there. He's still in my car for some reason. You're in my car. Hmm? You're in my car. No, your car's parked right next to me. You just haven't gotten out of my car. Ain't no way my cat likes you. I know he's focused on the rabbit. The rabbit already left though. He dipped. Oh my gosh, look at my eyes. Oh my gosh, my eyes are so puffy. I've been crying all day and now my eyes are like 
and puffy. So I got locked out of the house, meaning I'm gonna have to sleep at the guy's house, the guy that I'm talking to. Um, Shadow is with my dad right now for a little bit, just for the meantime. Um, honestly, my second option was taking him to like a shelter, even though that's like not what I want. I want him to be with me, I wanna love him and take care of him, but like, how am I supposed to do that when I don't have a place and I can't like, you know? give him the love that he needs i mean i can give him the love that he needs but it's just not the same when you don't got a place of your own like where i live i'm renting like i'm just like paying rent you know but like shadow can't stay with me like shadow can't stay with me and that sucks so i'm trying to look for a place that shadow could stay with me whether it's an apartment whether it's a room whether anything anything at all i don't care as long as shadow could stay with me then i'm good but anyways, I'm already at his place. I'm just waiting for him to come home so then I could go inside. I gotta go pee. And then I'm gonna go to sleep because I have work tomorrow. So I might have to wake up early to go home to get ready for work. But yeah, I think that's him. <laughs>